Hey guys, it's Curly Girl 323 back for video number three in this Curl Kit product review. And um, I've already talked about the little bar soap that was in there, and then I talked about the Aubrey Organic Conditioner, um, which I did use today. Um, again, I went, I did the Diva Curl No Poo to Start because I had um, a bit of producty kind of oily feeling hair, so I did that to start, and then I used the Aubrey Organics um, Conditioner, which you can check my video out and see my opinion on that. But then after I did that, I went ahead and deep condition. I know not everybody conditions before they deep condition, but um, I went ahead and decided to do the deep condition. And the product is this Alake Naturals. Oops. Get this, sorry. So it's Alake Naturals, and mine's the Honey and Sage Deep Conditioner. This is just a little two ounce sample, and um, I used part of it. I used about half of it up. Um, this whole thing was not full of mine. I don't know if it was supposed to be, but um, it wasn't 100% full. So I think this is bigger than a two ounce container. But I used about half of it, maybe a little more, but I'm going to get another use out of this. So I'm really excited about that. This smells really good. Um, it smells better off of your hair than on your hair. Um, it smells more honeyish off your hair, and then I think I smell more of the sage when it's on my hair. So um, I don't like it as much after it's on my hair, but I still, I mean, I really, I like this smell. So it's a good smell, and um, this is Curly Girl Method approved. All the products in the Curl Kit this month were, um, because it was the anniversary edition. And so there's no silicones or sulfates in, or anything like that in here. And um, you can visit their website at blackonyxworld.com, which I will put down below in the description box. So just in case you're interested in buying any of their products. Um, not everybody got this product because there were two different. There was a leave-in conditioner spray, I believe, and then the deep conditioner. And I'm really glad I got the deep conditioner because I'm actually looking for a good one. Um, so anyway, I applied this in my hair and I just, you know, I raked my fingers through and just made sure it was all the way in my hair. And then I um, braided it in one braid and then put the braid up. And then I have the Evolve conditioning cap from Sally's Beauty Supply that I put on my hair. And I ended up doing it for about an hour. Um, they say, you know, if you've got heat, you can do it for 15 minutes or 30 minutes without if you just put plastic wrap on. And the Evolve cap has plastic inside, so I, that's what I like about it. And it naturally heats your head by using, like, the heat from your head. Um, but I did it for about an hour, and um, I really enjoyed the results. Like, I was super happy. Now, it didn't feel, like, over-moisturized. I was kind of worried, or not really worried, but I was kind of curious about how it would turn out, just because it, like, it didn't, initially it didn't feel like it was um, going to be that heavy duty of a conditioner. But um, once I took my cap off and started to pull out my braid, like, I could totally just feel the moisture was just seeping into my hair and I loved it so my hair was um, feeling awesome and then I rinsed it out and I did it with like freezing cold water so I try to do that as much as possible when I do the full shower it doesn't always work but um, it was nice for this because I don't have my full body in the shower so I could just dip my head over and I'm okay with freezing cold on my head I just don't like it on my body but I do still try to rinse out my hair with as cold of water as possible and today it was freezing cold to wash out to rinse out the conditioner and since I had already used the no poo and another conditioner, my hair was already clean. So I didn't have to, you know, I didn't feel like I needed to go in and do anything more. I just went ahead and rinsed out, and I had already detangled, and I was good to go. And um, then I styled my hair as usual, which I will get to in my next video when I review my final Curl Kit product. But anyway, I really enjoyed this. I mean, I, this is, I usually use my Sally's Beauty Supply um, generic value products uh, conditioning balm um, as my base sometimes I do it just that and then I'll add some oils and honey and stuff like that for my um, deep conditioner treatment so that's the only kind of tried I haven't actually tried any like specific brands like I've had some recommended to me like I do want to try the curl junkie rehab and some others that I've heard some great things about but so this is the first deep conditioner I've actually tried that's specifically a deep conditioner and you know I'm happy with it so I don't have much to compare it to but this did exactly what I needed it to do and I battle frizz like no other and I've known that it's because I'm not getting moisture balanced into my hair and so I've been working on it working on it working on it and I finally feel like I mean I've got teeny little bit of frizz but I 
you can't get rid of it completely in curly hair, I don't think, especially on my head. And I just feel like pretty much f almost frizz free for the first time in like forever. Like this is the least frizzy I think my hair has ever been. And so, and I've just, you know, I've still been experimenting, even though I've been on the curly girl method for a while, I haven't been like completely like involved with it. I haven't been completely dedicated to it. So I've still been experimenting and I really didn't do the deep conditioning thing that I should have been doing from the beginning. And I just started experimenting with it. And this is the most it does. So I'm really, really happy with it. And I know that obviously my hair loves a proper deep treatment. So I'm excited that it's maybe finally reached that point where I can get the moisture in and lock it and have less frizz. And I'm just really, really happy with my hair today. So um, this, I think, played a huge role because it just it just caked my hair in moisture and got it started and I sealed it in there with that cold water and it was perfect. So um, I do recommend this product. I will probably try it again. I may try another deep conditioner first just to see what I prefer um, only because I haven't tried others but um, this is on my radar so it's very likely I will be purchasing this again. If they have any other scents I haven't checked that out. I may try different um, smells just because but you know the honey and sage nothing wrong with it. I enjoy it just fine. Um, and yeah, so I'll put the website down below in the description box, and I really liked this product, so, um, so far so good with the curl kit, we're two for three right now, so in terms of what I've enjoyed, so, um, now I'm gonna go to one final product in the curl kit in the next video, and I will review that one for you, so I will be back in a bit, bye!